All right, everyone, PackBot and I are here to open some more random booster packs throughout Magic's history. Let's see what we got today, PackBot. We got a pack of Dark Steel. Very nice. Let's see. Is there anything good in these? Wow. Sure, I know how to open a pack. Here we go. I'm gonna kinda look at the commons, but not too much. Let's see if there's any good standouts that um, really stand out, like a Whisper Slope Cloak, so I'd pull that, right? Got Uncommon Screams from Within, Arcbound Slith, Emissary of Hope, and Savage Beating for the rare. Uh, it's an instant for five. Play Savage Beating only during your turn and only during combat. Choose one. Creatures you control gain double strike until end of turn. Or untap all creatures you control, and after this phase, there's an additional combat phase, and then it can entwine for one and a red, even though that's a gray red. <laughs> that was a known error from uh, this set. And I forget what entwine is. Uh, I would have to look that up. Feel free to do so now. Let's see if it's going to be on camera. There we go. First pack away. Thank you, PackBot. Next up, Corset 2019. Oh! Oh, the whole pack. I'm really clumsy. I don't know if you guys knew that about me. I don't know if there's any... Yeah, I love the art for duress. It's awesome. Uh, I don't know if there's any good commons from M19. Oh, Reliquary Tower is a good uncommon. Double cast. Oops. Vigilant Baloth and a Sigil Sword of Valoran. It's an artifact for three. Equip creature gets plus two. Has Vigilance and is a knight in addition to its other types. Whenever equipped creature attacks, Create a 2-2 white knight creature token with vigilance that's attacking and equip it for three. Uh, pretty decent. Not a big one, I don't think, but it's decent. All right, next up, what is up? Pack of Nemesis, right? There we go. Um, nothing super big out of Nemesis. Ah, but we got the uncommons on the top, so we're gonna do, well, let's see here, one, two, three, Four. That should be the rare. We'll switch them to the back. Is that upside down? Hmm. Very curious. So some of these packs I get from um, full booster boxes, and some of them I've bought loose. And this is particular one I would have bought loose. So it's interesting to see an upside down rare in this one. Let's see what we get when we get there. Clownskate, Blastoderm, a toady. Seal of Doom, Harvest Mage, okay, Uncommons, Mind Slash, Belby's Armor, Coiling Woodworm, and Upside Down, Tangle Wire, which uh, has, it's an artifact for three, it's got Fading Four, at the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player taps an untapped artifact creature or land he or she controls for each fade counter on Tangle Wire. Uh, I don't think it's a good one. There's not really much out of Nemesis. And I don't think that was it for sure. So, if that was a tampered pack or just some kind of error on Watsy's part, I couldn't tell you. I don't think that pack was resealed, but you never know. So, how it goes in this biz right here. We're moving on anyway. Next up, a pack of Unstable. I don't think these would be tampered either. Looking for a foil basic land out of something like this. I got a really epic punch. It's so epic. Got a humming something. Got a stinging scorpion. It that gets left hanging. I love unstable. You should too. Entirely normal armchair. Midlife upgrade. Shellephant. By no means. Enchantment for three. Remove, play, pay to remove a counter from a permanent you control. Create a 1-1 one, one colorless gnome artifact creature token. Or pay to sacrifice an artifact to choose any kind of counter a printed card refers to. Then put one of that counter on target permanent. Interesting wording there. By gnome means. And we got a full art mountain. And a fairy airy is a mythic contraption. Whenever you crank Fairy Airy, create two 1-1 one, one blue Fairy Spire creature tokens with flying haste. And whenever this creature deals combat damage to a player, draw a card. 
exile them at the beginning of the next end step. This is good. Packbot loves contraptions. He's building an unset cube at some point. So that's a keeper. And some more contraptions and a foil. Ooh, sapling token with some art on the other side. Very nice. Throw that there. Okay, moving on is a pack of Shadowmore. One of my favorite sets to open. Runes of the Deus. Commons. Commons. Toil to Renown. A Pure Sight Marrow. Howl of the Night Pack. Fossil Find. And Prismatic Omen. Nice. So, enchantment for two. Lands you control are every basic land type in addition to their other types. That's probably pretty solid. That's one I would pick. So there we go. Alright, next up. 2015 core set. Anything good in here? We're going to find out. Negate. Solmender, a Juggernaut, a Constricting Sliver, a Quickling, an Obnixilis Unshackled. Very good. Legendary Creature Demon, 4-4 four, four for 6. Flying Trample, whenever an opponent searches his or her library, that player sacrifices a creature and loses 10 life. Whenever another creature dies, put a 1-1 counter on Obnixilis. Very solid. Alright. Moving right along, pack of conspiracy, take the crown. Whoops, told you, I'm clumsy. Got a beast, got another negate, got a kiln fiend, got a golem, murder, Nessian asp, runed servitor, spectral grasp, there's Kaya, and a sanctum prelate, that's a solid one. Uh, 2 2 human cleric for 3 as Sanctum Prelate enters the battlefield. Choose a number. Non creature spells with converted mana cost equal to the chosen number can't be cast. Take that. Yeah, that's a, that's a win right there, I think. And a conspiracy assemble the rank and vile. That's it. Alright, next up. Whoop. Well, I got two here. The next one's Urza's Destiny. But first, we're going to do this pack of Dominaria. Got a Snapper. A Raider. An Infection. Gross. And... Okay, let's just move those over. Alright. Memorial to Genius. Memorial to Glory. Sylvan Awakening is the rare. So we've got an Uncommon Legendary. Sorcery for three until your next turn. All lands you control become 2 2 elemental creatures with reach indestructible and haste. There's still lands. And a Tat Yova. Whenever land enters the battlefield under control, you gain one life and draw a card. That's pretty usable, right? Alright. Organize over here. Alright. Pack of Urza's Destiny. So. Like I said, some of these were from loose auctions. This is one of them. I guess I should check and see. Does it seem like it's been resealed? It looks a little sticky. It has been around for a long time now. The whole thing was sticky pretty much. We're just trusting in humanity here. All right, I'm gonna do the thing again. One, two, three, four. At least that one was the right way up. Got a knight, got a Kolos, some goblin masons, that guy's cool, taunting elf, hulking ogre, uncommons, Ra eradicate, extruder, sanctimony, and a scrying glass, not a big one I don't think, artifact for two, pay three and tap it, choose a number greater than zero and a color. 
target opponent reveals his or her hand. If that opponent reveals exactly the chosen number of cards of the chosen color, you draw a card. All right, there it is. Last pack up, pack of cold snap. This one is from a sealed box. Let's see what we get. Boreal Druid, which I think is an okay common. I'm gonna pull it there. Yeti, there's a snow covered mountain. Survivor. Scred, that's another pickable common there. So on commons we got resize, Juniper Order Ranger, Mishra's Bobble, very cool, very good on common right there. Put that in the rare pile, and we got a foil. Field Marshal for the rare, decent. Other soldiers you other soldiers get one one and have first first strike. It's a human soldier, two two for three, and for the foil, got a chill to the bone. Destroy target non snow creature. Looks good though. Alright, so I'm gonna scan these up and see how I did. Alright, ready to start scanning these up. Some decent commons here. Whisper Silk Cloak, different edition, it's probably pretty close, I'm just going to leave it. Oriel Druid, very nice. Snow Covered Mountain, there we go. A Scred, yeah, definitely some nice popper cards there. We got a Reliquary Tower. Uh, Mishra's Bauble should be a bit... That is a bit. Oops, 13 bucks, but I only got one. Minus one. There we go. Field Marshal. Decent. Uh, scrying Glass. So, yep, it's not a good one. So, that's how it goes. Sylvan Awakening. Also, Sanctum Prelate. Mythic from Conspiracy. Pretty nice. 10 bucks there. Obnixilis. Or something prismatic omen from Shadowmoor. <whistles> yep, that's a really good one. 23 bucks for prismatic omen. All right, got a fairy airy. Contraptions not a whole lot. I like them. Keep it though. Got a full art mountain. Yeah, three bucks. By no means, unstable rares really not worth a whole lot to anybody that's not making a collection. Tangle wire. That's actually pretty decent. 555. That's good. All right. And a sigiled sword of Valoran. It's okay. Savage beating from Dark Steel. So very nice. 6.99. So on my 10 packs, I got 86 bucks. That's really good actually. So anyway, thanks for hanging out with me and Packbot for a little bit. To make sure to Check out my other videos and check back for more nonsense later. Thank you.